Airlines welcomes you to Curacao, where you have just landed at the Hato International Airport. Please remain seated with your seatbelt securely fastened until the aircraft comes to a stop. Hey y'all, welcome to another Gage Tech Report where I'll be giving you a tour of Villa 19, an ocean villa located in a coral estate in Curacao. Coral Estate is a gated development in St. Marie, comprised of a number of homes and rentals, as well as a Coral Estate luxury resort. Coral Estate is about a half hour drive away from the airport and Willemstad city centre. Before we get to the villa itself, we first checked in via the main hotel lobby one street below. Marketed as the 270 degree ocean views from private pool and sun terrace villa, this fully air-conditioned rental has four bedrooms with three bathrooms. Two bedrooms have ensuite bathrooms, while the other two use a shared bathroom located in the middle corridor. The living room area has seating for four with a smart TV with access to Netflix, YouTube, Hulu and other streaming apps. The kitchen is stocked with all basic essentials for cooking and dining, including plates, cups, glasses, pots, pans and more. There is also a few basic seasonings, tea, an espresso machine and more. The kitchen also has a very good view of the pool area and Caribbean Sea. Arriving guests are treated to cold beers, soft drinks, bottled water and a few light snacks. The first bedroom is separate from the rest of the house right next to the poolside and is accessible via the patio doors. This room has views of the pool and ocean via the glass front doors and louvered windows. There are blinds which can be dropped when you need privacy in this room. Each room has the same recurring theme with a hangar rack space, drawers for storage, a clothing hamper and wall outlets for both North American and European charges. The bathroom has a reinforced shower head or noodle shower as some like to call it with an additional handheld shower head. There are all the essentials including lots of towels, soaps and gels and an illuminated bathroom mirror with defroster.
This is another bedroom located just to the right after entering the villa. It's the smallest of the four with views of the road and entrance area via louvered windows. Besides the storage spaces, this is the only room with a lockbox. As there is no ensuite bathroom, guests in this room will have to use the shared bathroom. The third bedroom also faces the roadside and has much more floor space, with similar amenities but no ensuite bathroom either. The final bedroom is quite similar to the first with its own ensuite bathroom. However, there is only one view of the pool and ocean via the glass doors facing the patio side. The smaller shared bathroom is located in between the three bedrooms in the main section of the villa and has a sliding door shower area. If you like the content so far, please feel free to subscribe and press that bell icon so you don't miss any future notifications. The pool area has both covered and uncovered sections with pool chairs, a dining area and couches. There's also a small rinse or shower after you're done taking a dip. There's also a barbecue pit for grilling. The terrace offers lovely views of the southern side of the island and the Caribbean Sea. And just below is a small stone area with a couch.
Villa 19 is managed by the Coral Estate Luxury Resort, which offers a variety of one to three bedroom hotel rentals, as well as other villas located in the area. The main hotel has the usual amenities, including three restaurants, a pool area, which villa guests have free access to, a spa, beach, and even dive tours and paddy training. If you want to read more on my thoughts about this villa, please check out my article in the description below. With that said, I'll leave you to enjoy views of the hotel area as well as a quick look of Otra Banda and Punda as well as the Queen Emma Bridge.
If you like this video, please feel free to subscribe to support this channel. I also send out a travel and aviation newsletter three times weekly. You can subscribe to that via the link in the description below.